pinkies out because we're sassy. Yeah. And welcome back to my channel. Thank you for joining me again. If you are new here, hi, my name's Amy. Nice to meet you. Thanks for joining. So, very excited. Um, today, I thought we would jump into the world of IG, Instagram brands. And I thought I would bring to you some items. Now, I've actually received so many pieces this fortnight. So, the past... <laughs> over the past two weeks... Your hands received a lot, so I thought it's only fair to share the excitement from myself to you. Pass it on to you, let you know what I'm receiving. I thought it could be fun. Oh, we're leaning. So, over the past two weeks, I have received quite a few items, and I thought it could be fun to share with you guys, open them up on camera, and let you know what I've got. Please excuse the reverse of my nails on this hand. They're blue cute um i painted this hand blue first and i was like lol no don't i'm not feeling the blue blue is not who i am today so then we changed them to pink and now annoyingly here we are also tan's a bit weird on the old hands we're gonna have to push past that and we're gonna make do amend is this annoying anyone because this is really annoying me that she's just chilling there like i have pictures and stuff but nothing to like <gasps> i just cracked my ankle i've got pictures and stuff but like nothing to hide her oh my god Stop coughing! Man! So, without further ado, let's jump on in and let's see what we have got. I'm excited! Let's start with this brand, actually. This is from a brand called Ferro London. And they're really edgy. If you guys like Sisters and Seekers vibes, like your smart casual, like your joggers, your blacks, your white, your neutrals, all things casual, fashion, sport, luxe, things then you will love Faro London. So, where's the parcel? Oh, I forgot the hat, where's the hat? Before we proceed, I just need to quickly say, some of these items I have actually already had to go and take content photos for. So, they have sent me a few more items that may not be in here. Sorry, just head over to my Instagram, which is Ames What, of course, and you guys will be able to see exactly how they look on. I'm not going to try any of these bits on because, Hans, you're going to have to see it over there because I see BA to get changed. We're not doing that right now. So, first brand, Ferro London Sport Lux. That kind of vibe, very edgy, very cool. I'm going to put in that it's a bit of a mm, Jocelyn, Miss Jocelyn vibe. Love it. So. Um, this jumper is one that I was gifted from them previously and it says they call us dreamers, but we're the ones that don't sleep I for one sleep, but I'm up all night partying They sent me along with these two jumpers a fluffy bucket hat, which says Faro London um, I've definitely got a picture of that on my Instagram. So go check that out. But the two pieces that I've got here is this jumper, which is my current fave and I've actually been living in, which says USA Sport and then it says Ferro. It's just grey and black. Absolutely love it. It's so minimal, but it's massive. Now, look at my little pea head in this jumper. There's nothing better than having a little pea head in a massive jumper because that's cosy, that's snuggly, that's exciting. And quite frankly, I that's how I want to be. That's how I want to be. So we've got the USA Sport. And we've also got this camel colour, which I love. And it says Nacha Baby, which maybe I am, maybe I'm not. Who knows? So, yeah, love those. Thank you so, so much, Faro London. I'm going to try to keep it snappy because we've got quite a bit to get through and I can chat on. Okay, the next brand we've got is an Instagram brand called Certified Money Clothing. And they're these two guys which actually live local to me and they are so, so cool. And they've been lovely enough to send me... Two tracksuits, which we love. Um, let's open one up. I won't open them both up because, like I say, trying to keep it snappy. But I actually love that they come in these bags because you can just hang these up or keep these in your drawer. And you know you've got the full tracksuit together. Does anyone else do that? They start wearing a jumper more than they wear the joggers. And then they want to wear the tracksuit together. And they're like, oh, where's the jumper? I've worn the jumper, you know? But if you've got your bag, you keep them together and that's real cute. But, so we've got him these cute little slim grey joggers this is the logo which is the cm 
and they go into a little cuff i absolutely love that they're like a slim jogger i've got so many oversized baggy joggers and stuff and i'm like hun maybe i need a slim one in my collection and now we've got two so that's cute so that's the bottoms and this is what the top looks like one thing i love ooh, here we go one thing i love about this is you can either have it like this at the bottom and keep it just like a standard crop or you pull these bad boys and it's like cropped and like tucked in and you can have it really slouchy. I don't know about you, but sometimes I'm feeling like a cropped jumper look, but I like it to be a baggy crop. So I like tuck the bottom of my baggy jumper into my bra, but with this, you actually don't even have to do that because you've got the drawstring. So thank you so much, CM Clothing. We love you. Next item, very exciting. <gasps> Tell me this isn't the nicest box. I think it's actually a football box. An American football ball box. But, um, you know, we're pushing past it. This is now going to be my new fancy box for fancy items. So, um, this, yes, is from NFL UK. A collab they did with ASOS. I, could cr I literally almost cried the other morning. The postman came to my house, gave me the box, took the box, and I was like, what is this massive box? Opened the box, and this little cute thing was inside. I just feel like a little proud mum. Like, what am I like? I love NFL, and I'm not a sports person, but NFL to me is, it's just cool. Like, I just feel cool because I like NFL. Anyone else? Anyone else? So, God. Okay, so, yeah, this is a collab that NFL UK has done with ASOS, menswear and women's wear. And if you love slouchy clothes, again, it's a sporty vibe. 10 out of 10, go have a look because some of their pieces are nice. I even might dive into the menswear because there are a couple of menswear jerseys which I'd like to wear as a t-shirt dress in this summer. Not joking. So, this says here, Amy, we love your style. Please find enclosed a sample of the NFL range available on ASOS. We'd love you to get imaginative, share and style. Many thanks, Jessica. So thank you, Jessica. Thank you, everyone. This is what makes me think it's a ball box because there's like this thing in here, which the top of the ball, because the ball was like, American footballs are shaped like, a bit like rugby balls, right? So first things first, we have this cute, which is a little pocket sized helmet. They're collectibles, actually, I think. And we've got... Who are we? Who are we? I think this is the Rams. It doesn't say. Hmm. Doesn't say. I think this is Rams. Really bad. Yeah, cute. But it's this little helmet, which is a collectible, which I know my dad is going to absolutely love. It would actually be really cute hanging from, like, your car. But this bitch can't drive, so we won't be doing that. And then the piece de resistance. Okay. As if the box wasn't enough. We've got a white knit, everyone. And this is... Chicago Bears National Football League. Look at how nice that is. The quality of this is super thick. Oh my god. This is only a medium. This is only a medium, and it's quite, this is a sizable medium. I will have to let you hands know what this is like, but you can see the color difference to how white this is. Like this is white. So yeah, loving this, it says team apparel, and it is the Chicago Bears national football team. My dad has actually fully got his eyes on this jumper, and he's like, Ames, when you're done, let me know. Okay, next parcel. We've got this jazzy little number from, oh, Star Power. Okay, I don't know if I've mentioned this. I've actually opened all of these things before. I'm just coming on here to show you what I've had. Did I say that? I don't know if I did. Hans, I've opened them all. I'm on here to show you what I've had this week. Star Power have actually been kind enough to send me their vitamin gummies. They've sent me, how long is it? A 30 day supply. So let me put this down. This is a little leaflet that came with them, and this is the size of the box. It says, the box? What is this? Tub? Pot? I don't know. It says bite me on the front, which is quite cute, and I'll show you what one of the gummies tastes like. What do they smell like, actually? This is open, I promise. It smells like jelly. It just smells like regular, you know, your usual jelly. And, ooh, it's 
squishy. This is what they look like. They've got a little star on them, cute. They're way softer than jelly. No, no, they're not. They're way softer than the Haribo, but they kind of have the consistency of like a hard jelly. But they're actually really, really nice. And as far as vitamin gummies go, they taste great. I did see one review with um, someone saying that theirs tasted bad after like three days. I haven't had that. I've been taking these now for about a week. I got these first thing this week, so... Yet to have that problem, but I will definitely let you know how these go. Um, at the minute, I've been doing my own nails, um, just with like stick-on nails rather than acrylics. So I can't really, I'm not really able to judge how quickly my nails are growing out because the stick-on nails I kind of have to keep replacing every week rather than every three weeks. Um, but hair-wise, skin-wise, I'll be able to let you know. It does say here you'll have hon hongolair, longer hair, healthier skin, and stronger nails. It's got folic acid, aloe vera, biotins, vitamin E, vitamin D3, vitamin C, vitamin B12, and vitamin A. So we'll see. Gummies. I'm always a bit scared to use things like this. I'm like, what am I putting in my body? I like, I don't want to be taking random things. I don't want to be taking things I don't know about. But they do sell these in Holland and Barrett's. And to me, that means it's legit. So I'll let you know what they're like. <laughs> okay. Huns at Viridi. If you guys don't know about this brand, I came across them recently when they approached me on Instagram. And they are definitely one for a more sustainable fashion route. They make some real sassy clothing and their dresses remind me of something I think Kim Kardashian would probably wear. They're very simple silhouettes, but like give you amazing shape. Um, they are so, so sassy. And, you know, for what they are, I don't think they're that expensive. So it comes with this little leaflet which says, Thank you for your purchase. For really, it's a non-seasonal label created with sustain... Why can't I talk? Created with sustainably sourced materials for those who want to invest in timeless pieces that are good for you and good for the planet too. I wonder if this is that seed paper that you can plant. Because it's got, like... Do you guys see that? It's got, like bits in it i swear there's this paper that has seeds in it that you put in the water and you water <gasps> it is it's the seed paper oh my god look you put it in the pot you water it and a plant grows tell me that's not the cutest thing ever from a brand to put something to put their promotional message on a piece of paper you can grow into a plant Oh, I'm going to grow a plant. I'm going to grow a plant. I'm going to call it Cornelius. And I'm going to let you know how it grows. Um, okay. Hey, Amy Lauren. Thank you for your support. Please enjoy your orchid dress. Love, Grace. So, this is how it comes. I have obviously opened it already. But it comes really, really sweetly wrapped. I do love it. Um, the dress I opted for is a longer version. I think it comes in a shorter version as well. This is going to be kind of difficult to show you. But let's have a look. So, I would describe it as a jersey material. And, okay, so from the front, it's kind of a square neck, really, really, really thin straps that cross over at the back. And it's just long as hell. I'd say, on me, I'm four, two, four, one, four, five foot two, five foot one. How tall am I? No, I hadn't stopped. I was still talking. This is going to be noisy. Just do the rice. So I have to sit here for eight minutes. Nine. BRB. So. Square neck situation, skinny little strappy straps, very stretchy, which we love. And then the back, I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see this, but, or, wow, I really haven't tied this up well. The back is like, you can't see this, the back is like this. It's like really, really low back, bunch of crisscrossy happenings, and I absolutely love it. I haven't taken a picture of this one yet, so you won't see this on the gram, but it's definitely coming soon when I have a next fancy event. I feel like this is the perfect sort of cocktail or date night outfit. Me and Jordan are going to Crazy Bear very soon, so I think I might be taking this bad boy with me. We'll have a look. Next item from my hands at Catch Me. Now, Catch Me. Catch Me, Catch Me, Catch Me. This is a brand which I think is so, so so underrated let's just take it back a step they're an affordable brand yes they are they are very very fashion forward in the sense that you can go on there 
I, I just feel like the whole approach on the whole puff sleeve situation is perfection. I love, love a puff sleeve shirt, a puff sleeve dress, a puff sleeve anything. And they've got it, let me tell you. So, Huns. If you're into your outfits where you want a jeans and a nice top kind of vibe, head over to Catch Me because they are incredible. Now, um, I'm going to do a little IGTV for them. So they have sent me over a few pieces for that. My thought process when selecting the items from the site was date day. Day drinking, drinks with the girls, cocky teas, that kind of thing. So I'm going to jump in here and show you what we've got. You'll see, I'm sure from this, you'll be able to see my vibe. I've got, actually, I've got two very different styles. I'm all over the place. This top I actually wore last night. Um, and I'm not about to sit here and do all the buttons. But it's a little pink leopard print blouse. Really cute fabric. The sleeves. You guessed it, a puff sleeves. So we've, it's a small puff on these bad boys, but it's a puff sleeve. And it's actually also a balloon sleeve. So it's got a cuff, which sits really nice and tight here. The front is this gorgeous 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 low v i'm really not showing it to its full potential but it's a gorgeous low v and it's got tiny tiny little buttons can you see that they're all in the same fabric down the front and the bottom is frilly really cute i wore that with black jeans and black jeans and military boots yesterday and that was cute um i've also got what else oh this now this is a bit of a crazy art it's not even crazy it's not crazy but i just thought i really like it so it's this white oversized shirt dress oh, i just got makeup on it big 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 shirt dress and this here i think it ties up around the back but it's got a tie around the waist so let me just try and hold it up in a way that might show you it's gonna sit like that how amazing with like a pair of black boots or even like chunky trainers i just think would look so cute so i'm loving her we've also got mm, this shirt which is collared it's got balloon sleeves with a cuff again which i absolutely love and at the front you've got this amazing tie up which can make a massive bow or you could tie it just the once and have like the um ties just hanging down i think that'd be so nice with a pair of blue ripped jeans and perspex heels love her why do i keep hitting myself in the face i'm like love her <laughs> that's that one um next item is a dress which is in the same pink leopard print material i just think it's so cute and it's real date night outfit puff sleeves yes and they're ruched all the way down and the whole dress is ruched which i just think is so flattering especially if you're going out for dinner somewhere fancy or you like drinks and then you're going out out you know when you're having drinks i blow so you know we like a ruching and then at the bottom of this one as well it's got that really cute little frilly hem which we love and then last item from catch me is this jumper 10 points if you guess what it has puff sleeves hang on i'm holding it backwards and i just stretched the hell out of it the actual body of the roll neck is in like this ribbed knitted material and then the sleeves are in this really soft cotton it is a puff sleeve, all right. They've got an amazing cuff again, which makes it a balloon sleeve as well. Um, but this puff, she big, but we like that. We do like that. We like the oversized look. And I think with the skirt and some white boots could look very cute. Cute. Wow, look at my sideburns. Maybe I should start shaving them. Do you think I should shave them? I don't know. Now, last but not least, let me just get let me just get them and then we'll have a discussion oh god what is happening sorry pr box sorry 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 pr box can someone explain to me what is going on in my life so i'm gonna do an actual video about this oh I've got an actual video coming about this next week. No, in fact, it's in like three weeks. I lied, sorry. In like three weeks time. But I got a PR package from Foot Asylum. What? Foot Asylum Women's sent me a PR package. 
I'm done. I'm actually, I was actually dying. I cried. I fully cried. But I thought I would show you hands what we've got. And we've got some things. So first things first, let's start with the campaign. So it was the Nike Blazer campaign. And we've got the new women's Nike Blazers in the black, white and grey. I have worn these because I need to get some content but this is what they look like i love these i really really do i think with like a little i wore them with a little denim dress and they looked so cool um they do run up slightly small so what i will say is i went with a four which is true to size and they are slightly pinchy so i'd maybe go half a size up if you can if not maybe even a full size but definitely go try them in in stores um or just order them a size up i don't know but I love these so, so much. I never really understood on blazers why they left this bit open, but I kind of like it. I think they're vintage-y. My first ever pair of Nike trainers that I bought with my own money were a pair of Nike blazers, the Nike IDs. I bought them in a mint green suede. Cute. And on the back, I had my initials, but absolutely love these and i think they're really 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 wearable i think they're a way to wear trainers and have a sporty look without it being crazy sporty like they still are kind of smart much like a converse that kind of thing so absolutely love her um for those of you who want to know they're the blazer mid 77s vintage because we're old um next we'll go with ye old reliables We've got a pair of Nike Air Force. Now, you can't go wrong with the Nike Air Force. These are the Nike Women's Air Force 107s. Um, I have worn these a few times, so please excuse the grossness. But they are a white and black pair. They came in a red pair as well. Now, Hunt, if you're looking for a pair, they had a red tick and the little Air Force like metal bit was gold i thought that was so cool and it was like such an edgy vintagey vibe so yeah i love those but i thought for me black and white is sort of where i'm at so i went with these they've got the little black thing here which i love and i love that the back is black the bit that connects to the ticks absolutely love these and these are an easy trainer to oh these are an easy trainer to literally wear with anything i'm styling these with jeans i'm styling these with dresses track suits the whole lot and they're super comfortable so <laughs> can never go wrong and the last pair of trainers hands the best for last that we have got from foot asylum women is the air max tailwind iv whatever number iv is that's what we've got you know the i and the v the old roman numes we've got her are you ready <laughs> and they're in this amazing mint green color like how how nice are they this is definitely a summer shoe i am going to be reaching for all the time imagine this with a pair of little denim shorts they are super comfy as well and they make your feet look diddy they make your feet look so tiny so i love these honestly so 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 cool and i cannot believe how lucky i am to have been sent these trainers like honestly I just don't I, don't, I don't get it, but I'm so, so, so grateful, and I would not be anywhere without any of you guys, so thank you so much. But yeah, guys, so in a few weeks' time, I'll definitely be talking to you more about the Foot Asylum collab, if you want to hear more about it, and I will definitely, definitely show you what they have gifted me next month. <laughs> I just can't believe it. Um, okay, so now I've got a large mess to clear up in front of me um i hope you enjoyed that video i don't know if that's something you wanted to do but i know when i'm on instagram instagram no we're not there we're on youtube i know when i'm on youtube i reach these videos quite often i love watching them and i can just binge through watching people open stuff for hours on end and not do anything myself but if you did enjoy this video please do give it a massive thumbs up comment down below your favorite item and if you want to see any more videos like this i will be sure to bring them to you i am not in any point just to put it out there bragging about what i've got i just thought i would show you because i love watching these videos myself and it's kind of interesting it's like when you go shopping in the most exciting <laughs> So like when you go shopping, the most exciting thing to see someone do is show you their shopping. So I'm showing you my gifting. 
very exciting but yeah as i said earlier on in this video if you do want to see any of these items in action in use head over to my instagram and you will see them all there all the brands that you guys have seen today will be tagged below so keep an eye out for those um yeah definitely do check them out because they have some amazing things and if they didn't I wouldn't be working with them so do take a look at their brands i love you all so 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 much can we focus here canon thank you i love you all so 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 much and i will see you next time